right now, I'm gonna show you a quick way to just make a, a favicon. If you have a logo, you can just use that in this case, but I'm gonna show you, if you don't have a logo, how to do a text favicon. Simple, straightforward, super clear. I've already created the board in Photoshop. I'm using Photoshop. If you have an account at Canva or something like this, it's the same exact process, but I'm gonna show you a couple tricks and tips to make this work. So as you can see on my screen, I've already actually created the icon. So it's a bit big right now, but the size of this board is 250 by 250 pixels. And then the font, I matched the font that we're using on the website. And so I just basically made sure it was aligned horizontally and vertically. And now the color I'm using. Okay, so with the web now, you have light mode and dark mode. You could use a full black because dark mode is not full black. It's actually like a off black. But in this case, this is a color I've seen work pretty well for light mode and dark mode. So let's just click into here and then I'm gonna click this little pencil and you'll see I've used the color 858585. It's about, it looks like it's just about 50% but it's a nice gray that works really well in light and dark. So, cause I'm in Photoshop, I'm gonna click on the, click out of this, click on the artboard. And here I will adjust the background to be transparent and that's good to go. And so if you have a logo, you just wanna fill this square as much as possible, leave a bit of padding, but for the most part, this should be good. And then I'm going to do Command S to save. Now I'm not saving the Photoshop, I'm just gonna do ADU. Favicon, and then I'm going to do PNG. So ideally, in this case, we will do a PNG. There's probably other ways to do this, but I'm just gonna do that. Okay, so back on the site, I'm gonna go to design, browser icon, upload, go to my downloads, upload that, and you'll see for the most part, it will look pretty clean, light mode and dark mode. So it hasn't popped up yet. Let's see if it shows up still loading the previous icon. There we go. So it shows up now. So you'll see the gray there. It's actually a little bit light, a newer thing I'm trying, but let's go here and I'm gonna go to dark mode and you'll see it still shows up. Now, ideally ADU, three letters, two letters is much more ideal. You'll see, even like you'll see as Coinbase, the C is probably about just a little bit bigger than what we have because it's just one letter filled with the blue box, but you could have a background for the color. You could do a lot of different things to make this work. But for now, I'm gonna switch this back, leave it there, and then we'll go from there with the client to figure out what's best. I, I don't know exactly what they may like to do there. But beyond that, now we could get into building some pages. Thank you for watching. Please leave a comment below if you have any additional questions. We make videos every single week. And so if you have a question below and we could help answer it, we may have a video response for you just in about a week here. So please leave your comments below. We'd love to hear from you. And if this video was useful to you, please hit that like button. For more content like this, subscribe. And with that, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.